My name is Claire Mason. Jonathan Graham. Hannah Bland. Dr. Girija Shinde. William Darden. James Fry. And I go to Chattanooga State Community College. Southwest Tennessee Community College. Southwest Tennessee Community College. TCAP Murfreesboro. TCAP Dixon. Motlow State Community College. And I'm the Director of Tennessee Promise. I teach cosmetology. The Department Head for Agriculture. This is the Office of Veterans Affairs. Professor of Biology. Studying Industrial Electricity. History major. My major is Education. When I heard I was nominated for this award, I was so honored. Honored to be part of it. Honored. Honored. Very, very honored. Extremely overjoyed. Shocked. Humbled. Excited. Pretty excited. It was an emotional roller coaster. First, I was sort of confused. A little confused. I was like, why me? Like, there's so many great people that I work with. But I was also excited, right? Like, I think I made it to be a finalist because I care a lot about uh, the citizens of Tennessee. Oh, I'm not sure. I have a. Um, I have a very positive outlook on everything. Productivity, uh, I think that's the biggest reason. I am very passionate about children. I love being with children. Maybe I've built some respect along the way. Throughout the professional journey, I have asked myself just one question. How can I help students learn? Because I have amazing faculty and amazing staff. My leadership qualities. I'm very proud of what we do and proud to be a part of the TCAT family. The most rewarding aspect of my position is when you are able to get that little golden nugget from a student when they call you and they tell you, hey, I just bought a car. Student success. Seeing students succeed. When a student has the aha moment. Just helping others. Just seeing students succeed. Walk out of Northeast State with a degree or transfer on to ETSU or where, whatever university, that's where I, that gives me the greatest satisfaction of all. The number one piece of advice that I give to my students is to follow their hearts and dreams. You have to be professionally perfect, but you have to be compassionate and caring. You have to continue to grow. Pay attention, take things seriously, and study, study, study. Show up, be on time, be prepared to stay determined. Never give up. Hang in there, and if you have a problem, please come see me. To always put the patient first. That if you love what you do, you never work a day in your life. The question that I asked many years ago was, what if I could go back and do it all over again? I hope that my students have learned their material. That getting a trade is the best thing that they could possibly imagine to do. I hope they learn the content, of course. But I really hope that they realize that it's about hard work, not natural intelligence. And just kind of be a sponge in there, soak up all that information, and then you'll find your own way. That's, that's, that's the goal. Go to work and keep it done. It's okay to start off at a community college. Students should consider TCAT Ripley because we have a very personal environment. The best faculty in the state. We're the best. <laughs> our faculty and staff care deeply about our students that attend there. For the simple fact that first and foremost, it's, we're family. We really are. After I graduate Motlow, I plan to attend Austin P State University. I want to finish my education. Uh, I'm planning on enrolling in I want to open up a clothing boutique and salon in one. Continue to be a clinical medical assistant. I absolutely love the work that I do. I work with an oncologist. Mentoring other students who are coming through. Working with children, that is my biggest goal. Wherever that takes me, we will see.